We did it, boys. After three whole months of waiting, Jinx versus Harley Quinn is finally out. What did I think of it? Was it good? Was it bad? Was it in the middle? I don't fucking know. But what I do know, that this is quite the funny Toto Power moment. So let's just get started and, and talk about the episode, what I liked about it, what I didn't like about it, all that fun stuff. This is my first review of the season. I don't know if this is a good start or not. Let's just begin. Fortnite Battle Pass! I just shit on my ass! Like all reviews, we have to start with the good stuff. And for me, it's literally everything. First off, the analysis. Jinx was done pretty well despite me only having watching Arcane. Really great show, by the way. Highly recommend. It's really good. And Jinx's analysis was done pretty well. Harley's, I really could care less about. Like, Harley's a good character, don't get me wrong. But I just think she's alright. Not the best, but not the worst. So, her analysis was done well. But the fight, though. The fight was done so well. It's a 3D, so obviously it's fitting for both characters to have 3D models. We'll get to those in a bit, but just know they're good. Anyway, the freaking hand-to-hand -hand combat was, was really good. They made great use of their weapons. The environment made sense. You know, Harley is a clown in a way. And Joker. And Jinx. I know. I won't say exactly like a clown, but it fits. But the fucking mirror room scene. That that is just pure gold right there. What? Chef's kiss. And the kill was really interesting. Harley tried to pull a Joker back in Joker vs. Sweet Tooth, but Jig said, nah fam, that ain't happening, and then literally blows her up like a firework. And also, get Jinx in the background. I think that's a really nice touch. Speaking of, you know, nice touches, I, they made a reference to the Blake vs. Mikasa. I don't know, I just think that's nice to point out. Luigi, hello Mario! Now surprisingly, this doesn't have too many issues. Except for only two. But they're minor. First off, the models. While I said they were good, they feel a bit off. Jinx has a more realistic ish look to her. Harley's look a bit more cartoonish. Like it feels like it's from a video game. Pretty sure it is, but I don't fucking know for sure. Again, they're good, they just feel a bit out of place. Second issue is Ringmaster. Why is he here? Like you don't have a problem with Ringmaster, unlike other people who do. I think I think he's a fine enough character as he is. But I don't know why he's here. But yeah, besides that, I could really care less about his inclusion in the episode. Again, he's fine, I just couldn't care less. This is a pigeon. <laughs> I feel like Charlie Brown, except I ain't brown. Bitch, I'm green. So what I think of this episode overall? I fucking loved it, man. Enjoyed it the, the whole way through. Good analysis, good fight, good everything, basically. Not the best season premiere, that title goes to Yoda vs. King Mickey by a long shot, but this still deserves a 10 out of 10 in my book. And for next time, we get two DCLs in a row, let's go!